Hey y'all, it's your boy Rob here. Holla at your boy. Or some shit. How's everybody out there in Facebook land doing? Uh, video looks a little choppy to me, so I don't even know if I'm broadcasting right now, live or not. Uh, I just thought I'd check in with everybody, see how you're all doing out there. Getting down on Friday, because you got to get down on Friday, am I right? All right, Rebecca Black would be proud of each and every one of you. Remember that as you go through the day. Rebecca Black is proud of you all. Um, well, it's been a while since I've done one of these, so I figured what better time than sitting in a parking lot of a Burger King while my son gets a cheeseburger. Um, it's been an exciting, what, 40 minutes or so. Uh, we went to the gas station to get some gas in the car and some gas in a gas can. Fairly simple. Robbie was paying 15 for gas because i got to drive him somewhere tomorrow. I was paying $3 for gas in a gas can. Robbie used my bank card to pay for the $15. Now, unfortunately, I'm like a lot of Americans out there, and I just don't have that much money. So the 15 overdrew my account. Um, so he had to uh, deal with getting that overturned. So that was fun. And then he finally fixed that and put the $3 uh, prepaid to a pump. And they put it on the wrong pump, so we had to go get that fixed. So we sat there. I listened to damn near all of Rush's Fly By Night album. Now, that's not a bad thing, my friends. I like Rush. Don't judge me. Okay? Getty's voice may hurt your head. It does not hurt mine. Uh, but it was pretty exciting. Um, what else is going on in my life? I am still waiting on my final uh, foot to come in. That's right. I'm waiting for my foot to come in. It's, it's strange to be saying that. Uh, I tested it last week, uh, a week ago Thursday, and I did pretty good. I, I did a nice little walk, so that was uh, that was exciting. And now I'm just waiting to uh, receive the final foot and walk out of there. Uh, it's very strange walking on a prosthetic foot, my friends. Um, it's it's obviously it's not like walking on a real foot. Uh, you got to kind of think about every step you take uh, and every move you make and every breath you take. I'll be watching you. Uh, but you gotta think about every step uh, because, I mean, at least I did, and you know, it might be just be new to me, and later on down the road, I'm sure it'll be more like second nature. Uh, but for now, it was very strange, and um, I think when I walk out of there, it's it's gonna be strange for a while, but I guess at least I, I'm walking, so I guess I got that going for me. On the baby front, uh, Hope is now three weeks old today. Uh, when she was born, she weighed seven pounds, four ounces. She currently weighs like 6.94, so 6 pound 94 ounces. I don't know how that works, 6.94. Um, that's in kilograms or some shit. 2.94. 2.94. That's kilograms or so. It's, it's a weird measurement, but basically she has not gotten back up to her birth weight, and they expect her to do so by now. And unfortunately, she just has not. She's having trouble putting on the weight. Uh, the doctor is mildly concerned, but she's finally putting on a little bit and so they're giving us another 24 hours to see what happens so we're crossing our fingers that everything is going there so if you're a praying uh praying man or a woman uh or you just have some good vibes to offer up uh, we'd appreciate those you know i almost sound somewhat articulate this video and that doesn't happen a lot i don't think i like it i don't think i like it a lot my friends but anyways that's what's going on in my life right now um, of course, we've got uh, all of the kids at home. Uh, Samantha has been here this week, and it's been nice. I love having Samantha home. Um, and unfortunately, I mean, fortunately, unfortunately, I don't know. Uh, she's a lot safer at, at our house. I'm not going to go into any kind of details um, on Facebook. That's a whole lot of dirty laundry I don't want to air. But, uh, you know, some stuff going on on the um, that front, too, that we're just, like I said, not going to get into. So I probably shouldn't have said anything. I guess I'm vague live feeding, um, but yeah, so that's that's been unfortunate. But I love having all the kids home. We currently have uh, seven children in our house right now, three of mine, three of Julia's, and then, oh, obviously both of ours. So it's, uh, you know, there's nine of us in this house. And you would think it'd be crowded, but it's really not. Uh, it's a decently sized house. You wouldn't know it from looking at the outside, but it's got a pretty nice sized basement, so. We're not exactly stepping on any toes out there, although we do have an odd number of toes thanks to my missing foot, that's right. Uh, thumbs up for missing foot. Uh, so, you know, that that's, you know, stupid foot. Uh, next week, next week, uh, school starts up again uh, here in Shenandoah, Iowa, and I'm 
very much looking forward to that because it'll be quiet in the house again. We can catch up on some sleep. Well, no, I mean, the baby keeps us up, so there's that. And then it's uh, political season is in full swing, my friends. So we're busy there. Don't forget to get out and vote in November. Uh, you either vote to keep the Republicans uh, in, uh, in control or get them out. Either way, uh, make sure you get out there and do that. Uh, especially if you feel strongly one way or the other. I do, and I know which way I'm going to vote, but I'm not going to get into it here. Uh, let's just say I'm not the biggest fan of the Cheeto Man. Uh, but uh, that's not to say all Republicans I'm against. Just not his biggest fan. As a person, uh, just a little immature, but I'm not going to get into politics here because, let's face it, no one cares about my political opinions. No, you know what? You honestly don't. You could, like, get angry and flame me, but in the end, do you honestly really care about my political opinions? The answer is no, you really don't. And maybe you want to start stuff on Facebook or YouTube or whatever and getting in, get in an argument, but basically, in the end, do you really care about somebody else's uh, political opinion? I don't. So... I guess just back off on that a little bit, and I'm sorry I even mentioned it. I've mentioned two things I shouldn't be talking about this video. I guess we should talk about my uh, hemorrhoids. I don't, I don't have any. Wouldn't that be fun? Another issue to add onto the list, right? Uh, but otherwise, uh, things are going pretty good. I can't complain too much about uh, the usual goings and goings on. Uh, Hope has been amazing. Uh, she's been very alert today. Uh, eyes wide open, pretty blue eyes, and she's just, she's just a miracle. She's a little godsend baby. I love her so much. Uh, and of course I love her mom. Uh, so it's, it's been nice doing this. Anyway, I'm sick of rambling on here. Uh, so I guess I'll stop bothering you all uh, for now. Thank you all for uh, watching this. And I have said uh, a lot and maybe next time I ramble incoherently or coherently, depending on how you look at it, I will try not to say the word uh quite so much. Thank you for tuning in. Until next time, toodles.